overall, it was a good card. There were some, I guess, upsets that I wasn't expecting, like um, Melvin Gillard lost, which I wasn't expecting him to lose. I was expecting him to just dominate that fight because he was on a five-fight win streak. Then you had um, Kenny Florian, which uh, I think got ripped off. I think he, even though he held a, held the champion against the cage a lot, he was still doing more octagon control, in my opinion, and uh, I think he should have won. It was not a a, 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 a 48-46 fight. I don't see Aldo did anything really that crazy to win the fight, so I think Kenny got ripped off, but you guys can post in the comment section below if you think my uh, opinion is so wrong. So overall, I would say the UFC 135, 136 card it was really good. I actually enjoyed it. Some of the fights, like I said in the beginning, were upset. I thought Melvin Gillard was going to win. I thought uh, Gray Maynard was going to win. Um, I wanted Kenny Florian to win, and Kenny Florian didn't win, which I'm still very disappointed by uh, his loss. And um, like, like a lot of, it's, it's weird. People say Jose Aldo is one of the top three pound pound guys into the world. Well, Mark Hominick took him five rounds, and he had that big lump on his face, and Kenny Florian took him five rounds, and he's winning by decision. It's not like he's going out there and, like, just whipping fool's asses, and I love Chael Sonnen. Chael Sonnen told like it was. If he loses against Anderson Silva, he's going to re he's gonna quit uh, and retire out of the UFC. I think Chael Sonnen is number one. Before, I don't care if he was on steroids or on illegal drugs or whatever. He whipped ass. He said it like he was going to be said uh, Saturday night in a steel cage. I'm going to get whipped with his ass. And he beat Brian Stan like it was nothing. And I think after he called out um, Anderson Silva, when he first called Anderson Silva, the can they showed Anderson Silva in the crowd. He looked like, he's like, he kind of looked like, that's my opinion on UFC 136. Um, the best fight, I think, was Chell Sonnen's fight. And I think Chell Sonnen has the right to uh, say um, he will retire if he doesn't beat Anderson. Because, look at it this way. I was surprised the way Chell Sonnen won by a submission. I've never seen that dude pull off submission. And he pulled off an arm triangle against Brian Stan. And um, Brian Stan was on like a, a five-fight win streak or something like that. And Chell Sonnen just came off a loss, but Chell Sonnen is a beast, ladies and gentlemen, and um, I hope they have Anderson Silva versus uh, Chell Sonnen, too. I'm a big Chell Sonnen fan, not a big Anderson fan, but um, talk to you guys later. Yeah, this is